need you calling me and badgering me, my own sister. You know, I'm doing everything the right way. You know, I, I have a freaking farmer's tan right now, right? My skin's on fire right now. And you know why? Because I bust my ass doing construction all goddamn day. And then at the end of the week, when Friday comes, 75% of my check goes to Miranda so she can do her nails or whatever. And I'm doing everything the right way and you're still calling me and making me feel bad about crap. Because Joey, she's my friend. And I've stuck up for you enough. And she's going to therapy now. Like she put herself in therapy because of you. So I'm just telling you, like, maybe you should just back off. I, I know you did the custody stuff, but just seeing her probably causes her trauma. It, like it's my problem that she's going to therapy. I didn't tell her to go to therapy. And then, and then you also frame it that she's your friend, this and that. You, again, you forget that I'm your brother. Why do you talk about her like she's your blood sister? She's my, my ex-wife. And you talk about, I, I don't understand your allegiance to her. I understand you have a bond and all that and she helped you in the past through tough times, but I'm your brother. These aren't things that she's gonna tell you and it is your problem. You're the one that caused her to go to therapy. You're the one that caused her all this baggage. And I know that's hard to hear, but I'm telling you this as your sister so you can make the right decision. I know you went to see Junior and you went to court and everything, but every minute that you're in your, her life, you're causing her trauma. Are really gonna frame it like that? That your own brother drove his ex-wife to therapy? That's how, how you view me? What did I do in my relationship with her that drove her to therapy other than cheating on her? Okay, maybe that does warrant a little bit of therapy, but plenty of people get cheated on every single day and they, they're not in therapy. You act like I'm this heinous dude. I never cursed at her. I, when I raise my voice, it's, it's in a conversational, you know, normal arguing way. Never raised a hand to her, never raised a hand to my son. So I, I gaslit her a few times, that's gonna send her to therapy. You really are like mom. After all this time, you still can't see everything that you've done wrong to Miranda. You can't see like every way that you've hurt her and messed with her head and you really just can't see any of it. I really don't know what I did to her, okay? Yes, I cheated on her, I apologized to her, I tried to make up for it, I stuck up for my mom a few times. I don't know what else you want me to do. Other than that, Gabby, I'm doing everything the legal right way. I went to court, okay? I'm paying my child support, I'm doing the visitation rights, I'm doing the supervised visits. I'm doing everything I'm obligated to do. So you can't say nothing about me. I'm sorry she's going to therapy, but that ain't my problem anymore. She's my ex-wife, she's not my current wife. I didn't cause her to go to therapy. Those problems were there before I met her.